Hello, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, depending on your location. This is GMTV. GMTV gives you all the news around Brafa land in Nigeria and also in around Africa. Yeah, I think uh, everybody knows about this boy called Kamsi. This boy has been kidnapped by Nigerian terrorist um, army. Um, in the village in Enugu state this boy has been kidnapped in a way whereby on a broad daylight people were there but because those people are carrying arm the people that came to kidnap this boy they carrying arm so because of that the there's no way people can confront them and let the boy be free this is all they do every time you see, this is uh, how they intimidate people. When you're trying to spring up, you're speaking out for something that is going on in the country. They will come and shut everybody down. Like in a way, these issues has been going on for a very long time. This is how they intimidated all these uh, Hohaneze and the, all the chiefs and in the villages and the states. This boy have to be released as quick as possible because if we keep quiet on this this is going to keep continue happening because it's just somebody that it didn't happen to that's when you know oh it doesn't concern you this concerns everybody this is just 11 years old boy that is speaking up his mind it's not even just a, a ordinary boy he's a comedian it say funny things. It tells people story. It tells does does funny things to make people laugh. They just took him as uh, if he uh, has no but on the broad daylight. This issue has to be um, put in a in a way whereby people can suggest what to do because they started from the Hwanese, the, the chiefs, and they come down to the youth. Now this this boy is in primary school, he's an adolescent. We can't just let this evil continue to happen in this country. We say Biafra need to go. Is he a force to stay in a place where you don't like? So nobody can speak. No freedom of speech in the country. Everywhere you go, you see intimidation. This is how they use the intimidation everybody for to submission, but it's not going to be the 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 end way of uh, giving these people headway to be coming into our community and taking things on a, a, on their own. Nobody is going to say anything about it. We we'll see what is going to happen in the coming days. All these uh, chiefs of Hanese and other people, village elders and if they didn't speak up, then the children will take action on this. Because we cannot just let evil continue happening to our people like this as if uh, we are nobody. It's because people are not speaking. When the youth rises up now, the elderly people will say, Oh, calm down, calm down, calm down. And all this evil keep happening every day. No, it, this is too much. And uh, there's a lady there as well that they were dragging on the floor. This one is in a different village in Delta State. Is uh, the name of that village uh, is uh, Agbaro. The name of the village is Agbaro. That woman that they were dragging on the floor, they even strip her even naked. In the po in the presence of people there. What what kind of crime are, have they committed? Nothing. Just intimidating people in the community, letting people be scared of uh, uh, moving around or coming around or doing anything. This is very serious. The, everybody have to come put hand together and sort this thing, issue out because it's going to cause a uh, fight between, between communities. Because as this thing is going now, nobody is, in, nobody is happy about what is going on right now nobody is really happy the government have to sort things out they have to sort things out all these terrorists coming to villages look at this young boy of 11 years old boy
just intimidating him, dragging him, put him in a in a in a, a car or truck and drove him off to an unknown destination. Even the mom was even brave enough to jump on uh, her bike and and run after them. I can I know everybody have been seeing this video, but I cannot post it here because um is uh, is 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 too is too bad it's too emotional to watch imagine is your your son imagine if your child 11 years old moving around like this and uh, people people will not say anything you don't even know the fate where they are going where they are taking this boy to nobody knows this thing have to stop the afro people they are going home it's not by force to stay together. When a woman and a man might get married, or if they don't like each other anymore, they have easy way to separate. So we are not together with Nigeria. Nigeria is a terrorist state. This thing has to be stopped. Intimidating people. You know, those people were in the compound there watching them. But you can't go close to them because they have arm in their hands. So if you go too close to them, they might, you might be likely get shot. And that her life will be wasted. This thing has to stop. It has to really stop. Things are, things are not getting uh, uh, better. Instead of things to get better, it's getting worse every day. Why would they allow terrorists... People come into our land and be intimidating people and then they'll go free. No, this is just the end. Well, if you know what you have to say about this, please put it on the comment section because everybody is angry. We cannot let these people just go away like this by coming to our community, treating people as if uh, we are animals. This thing have to stop. That to really, really stop. They're intimidating everybody. What is the problem with these people? If they don't have job to do, they just go out to their office and sit down. They will see armed robbers on the road. They will ask them to go because they are all together. They work together. But ordinary person in the community, you have no freedom of speech. You cannot talk. If you talk, they will start locating where you live and, and get come uh, in the middle of the day or all night and be kidnapping people. Well, we have to stop here and uh, I'm very, very angry and this issue have to be sorted out as quickly as possible because we are tired of uh, hearing all these bad things every day and night. Somebody cannot sleep and close eyes. This is ridiculous. This thing have to stop. Seriously, I have to really, really stop. And these are the things that happen in other places as well, other villages around whereby nobody knows. Thank God for that guy that was able to video this uh, issue, video them, and uh, that's how we got this information. There are some things that are happening in the secret of which nobody knows about. Well, thank you for watching anyway. Also, please do us a favor to comment and also subscribe to our channel. Bye for now.